A public school superintendent is stepping down from the job weeks after Call 6 investigates exposed a $1 million mistake. Taxpayers in the Richland Bean Blossom School District are reaching are having to reach into their own pockets to pay for that mistake. Call 6 investigates Kara Kinney broke this story and is working to hold decision makers accountable. Dr. Mike Wilcox submitted this resignation letter to the school board this afternoon. He's been serving as the superintendent for Richland Bean Blossom for the past five years. The letter does not give a reason, but Wilcox's resignation comes after Call 6 Investigates exposed a paperwork mistake he made that cost taxpayers on their tax bills. Dozens of taxpayers showed up to a school board meeting on May 21st in Ellisville to protest the error. The mistake happened as the superintendent was filling out financial forms to send to the State Department of Local Government Finance. The error is costing some homeowners hundreds of dollars on their property taxes. Taxpayers say they shouldn't have to pay for the error and some have called for resignations. The district is using the extra money to reduce interest on future debt payments, but taxpayers say they should get a refund. Call 6 Investigates was at the board meeting last month when Dr. Mike Wilcox had this to say about what happened. The timing of this was less than perfect. Uh, but absolutely, absolutely unintentional. I have never wanted anything less than the best for this corporation and this community. I would do anything for anyone or any group at RBB. Thank you. Assistant Superintendent Dr. Jerry Sanders will serve as the interim superintendent while the district searches for a replacement. The school board president says they wish Mike well and that he's been part of a team that helped turn all of their schools into A-rated schools. Erica.